nigga. Yo, I'm buying me a midget. That's horrible. <laughs> Also, why? Get out! Get out of there! Get out of there! I got Fuck. everything I need in my house, man. I got a big ass chair to sit in, a big ass fur coat, a crown, a chalice, some wine, and a dancing nigga. A wine, motherfucker! You don't even drink wine. I have class. Uh, okay. Okay. You drink what alcohol, the what the fuck you mean? What, what, what's the first stupid thing you would buy? I wouldn't buy anything stupid. I don't waste my money. Well, what's the first thing you'd buy, then? Uh, probably my fucking driver's license. That's fair. And then, if I still had the money, a car. Dream car or just a car that gets you from point A to point B? Point A to point B. I'm not gonna be like Randy. Hey Lucio, I'm not an asshole. You can't punch right. I was fighting Jack the whole time. I powerbombed my own brother. God damn. Hey, hey, that ain't funny, man. Why you gotta have the window, though? Come on, let's punch our way through it, man. So this hasn't happened the first time. What? Jesus Christ! Uh oh. Hello. Bring the action. Boost. Bring the action. Jesus Christ, man. $7,000 for one cocktail? The fuck? Where? Dubai. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
want to buy that shit. They better fucking give me superpowers or something. Most rich people go there to just, you know, waste money and stuff. Yeah, like I know I said I like I buy stupid things, but I'm not wasting it on stupid shit like that. Okay, but what's up with the fucking goddamn Avenger music playing right now? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, I was like, I I'm looking, I'm watching uh, the Simon React channel where they're watching basically a video called Inside the World's Only Seven Star Hotel. And inside this hotel, they have a seafood restaurant surrounded. <laughs> Surrounded by an aquarium, and they're like, "Yo, whoa, 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 what? Why? That, you're, you're basically taunting them at that point. <laughs> so you're taunting the fish, <laughs> like." <laughs> no. Nah, I was watching this uh, one. It, it, I don't know if you've ever heard of it. It's called a Daily Dose of Internet. Yeah, I've heard of it. Yeah, and so what they did, fucking ocean, and in order to get pizza, they have to have a fucking person deliver it by scuba diving and shit. What? Yeah. I was like, what the fuck? And dude, the box is dry as hell. They they put it in a container to where it doesn't nothing none of the water just gets in it at all. And I'm Jesus, like, get man. the fuck out of here! Imagine giving that guy a tip. Like you can't give that guy like twelve dollars or twenty bucks. Yeah. My man just my man just swam just to give you a pizza. Okay, see that, that that that's just completely unnecessary. I know you're offering it, but I wouldn't take it. So I know I'm paying this much money, but you you don't have to unpack my stuff or pack it for me, man. Okay. I I I'd feel really bad. You yeah, alright? What do you mean? I, I've come to the conclusion that I can't, like, there's a certain level of class that I can accept. I can't go, like, to these extremely bougie-ass places. Like what? I don't know, because just, like, like, there's some places, like, not just here in America, 
look all over America where like they have these high standards and they, they also expect certain standards from their guests like even if you step out of line just by like doing something that you normally do they just like they're like completely appalled by it you know what I mean right yeah I was like, yeah, I, I, was like, I don't think I can go to these places. I mean, like, there's any, like, places, like... Like, have you ever thought of, like, any bougie-ass places you wouldn't go to? A fucking French restaurant. I refuse to go to any fucking French restaurant. Because the Is portions... The no, the portions are very tiny. It's very fucking tiny. I mean, like, do you think they, they exaggerate? and stuff but they don't they literally have a small piece of chicken with a you know some mustard on the side or whatever or some sort of sauce and they put some like a like green leaf on it and then voila five hundred dollars more like sixty or seventy but either goddamn way it was it's just bad Like and I always thought I was like, why is it like certain like some certain restaurants just up the price because they're using gold in the food? I never understood that shit either. Redfield. Been looking all over for you. I'm here to help. 